met in school actually, mm -hmm. high school. Tukimaliza shule mm -hmm. in that was 2019. Mm -hmm. That's when we made it official. Mm -hmm. Unaona? Mm -hmm. Juu after saa kuongea 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 nini nini mm -hmm. eh some point ikafika kaniambia okay. So we've been talking for a while now we've been friends and mm -hmm. I would really like you to be my girlfriend. So is it a yes or no? Enyewe mm -hmm. ningengojea bado. Hata as much as angeniambia bado 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 I was ready to wait. Nikimwambia mm -hmm. it's okay you can just think of it mm -hmm. every time na mwambia hivyo. Unaona? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. Hello and good evening. Hope you had a lovely week. This is Kapo's Will Show and this is where we write down our love. When well, we are alive for we don't want our love story to be read when we are six feet under. Neither we want our love story to be read when we are gone. That is why every Friday at 9.45 we gather here to tackle issues concerning marriages and i bring you different couples who come to share their journey with us and also bringing experts who come to handle issues that married people go through where else can you get such a program it is only on wema tv the voice of hope and my name is willie kinyash now kipenda doctor love and out there they call me the undisputed karibuni sana to tonight show and tonight I am having it's this this one you love it in ile na mbianga mtapenda because the couple I'm having they are not yet married and the reason why I brought them here it's because they have taken too long in dating and I want to know why have they taken years and they are in love what is making them not to get married and i am hosting purity and farouk and that name again there is a story behind it and so join us as we listen to this amazing love story hi guys hi, hi. <laughs> Asante. good to have you here it's oh, okay. good to be here yes yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so kindly you Thank you. can introduce your yourself to our viewers. Yeah. Okay, so I'm um, Purity Gatwiri. Those are my two names. Yeah, I don't know if it's names. Name. Purity Gatwiri, yeah. Yes. Yeah, that's my name. Purity Gatwiri. Yeah. And, and um uh, and um my name is Farouk Abdi. Farouk Abdi Jamal. Farouk Abdi Jamal. Abdi Jamal. Jamal. Yeah. Niliwaambia that name there's a story <laughs> behind it and we'll be, we'll be talking about that <laughs> later and they also have a youtube channel it's called um life with the bavakas life yeah. with the Baka, bavakas yes yeah. yeah. bavakas yeah, yeah. kindly check out life with the bavakas, bavakas mm -hmm. and you'll be able to see what they are doing out there they are doing an amazing work out there and remember to subscribe to their youtube channel <laughs> so karibu ni sana <laughs> santi so you guys mm -hmm. how did you meet and where <laughs> ladies first <laughs> <laughs> umeruka umeruka <laughs> 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 okay so we met in school actually mm -hmm. high school high school yeah we, uh, i can say we were friends cuz uh, our school and their school mm -hmm. we considered their school our brother school in high school ah. so which school is this okay it's one in Meru. i don't know if you know gikomene girls high school gikomene yeah sawa <laughs> that Meru, <laughs> typical. <laughs> so uh, that was Gikomene girls and their school was Chogo boys. Chogo. Yeah. Chugu. Chugu. Yeah. Yes. Ah, okay. So each time maybe we went for a uh, well, these books zinaitwa aje set, set books. Set books. Yes. <laughs> we could I could see him uh -huh. to kenda music festivals, uh -huh. but don't know you see. Uh -huh. And 
after school pia uh, tukifunga maybe shule hata mm -hmm. nyumbani bado mm -hmm. we were still friends mm -hmm. cuz unapata labda beshte yangu mm -hmm anamjua mm -hmm. so anytime maybe there is maybe a concert mm -hmm. uko nyumbani tukienda bado nitamuona you see yeah. so kulikuwa na ile friendship mm -hmm. ata kama si tulikuwa tunaongea sana mm -hmm. there was that friendship yeah. he knew me mm -hmm. i knew him mm -hmm. so in school eh, tulikuwa tu mabeshte ni nini mm -hmm. so uh, tukimaliza shule mm -hmm. in that was 2019 mm -hmm. That's when we made it official. Mm -hmm. Unaona? Mm -hmm. Juu after saa kuongea 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 nini nini mm -hmm. eh some point ikafika kaniambia okay. So we've been talking for a while now we've been friends mm -hmm. and I would really like you to be my girlfriend. So is it a yes or no? Mm -hmm. Actually he made it really official. Yaani si ile tu mtu mnaongea <coughs> alafu mnajipata mshanza ku date. Mm -hmm. He was so straightforward like he asked me to be his girlfriend and mm -hmm. I was like Mm -hmm. <laughs> so did you yeah. give the yes answer yeah. right there or later okay it took me a, a, a lazima to ringe kidogo ati wacha nitaombe kusema yes niko <laughs> ah, ah ngoja ngoja nifikirie <laughs> so nika nifanya fanya hapo nafikiria and lakini ndani yako this is the boy juna talking stage tuli alikuwa shapita kila like vibes mm -hmm. there were vibes yeah, yeah. so i was like yeah it's okay mm -hmm. i'll be your girlfriend and that's wow. when it was made official mm -hmm. so yeah so um ile time alikuuliza mm -hmm. take how long kumwambia yes um I, it was a period of days mm -hmm. juu bado tulikuwa tunaongea ananiambia ulifikiria mm -hmm. what did you think about my proposal and I'm, ah bado 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 mm -hmm. <laughs> bado sija come mm -hmm. to a decision mm -hmm tunaendelea kuongea siku ya pili hivyo 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 bado ulifikiria bado mm. okay sikumbuki kabisa it was like siezi sema precisely ilikuwa like three days ama four days mm -hmm. but it took a period of days mm -hmm. yeah <laughs> yeah it was a period of some days then i gave him the answer mm -hmm. yeah you know every time i have hosted couples here yeah um i always get different versions of how guys met, met. Yeah. so let's hear his version <laughs> <laughs> oh, on my side that as a nairobi na unajua mimi exactly kenya mesema that's exactly what happened okay of which mm -hmm. one thing yenye niliona it was so it took me time mm -hmm. i'll take time sana mm -hmm. could decide kama atakuwa girlfriend yangu because mm -hmm. at that point ni shatu pa me star ni mezaribu kila kitu ni chisha jiambia hapa ndipo lakini bado unaona mimi mimi nikijiambia lakini i was sure that enyewe ningengojea bado hata as much as angeniambia bado 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 i was ready to wait nikimwambia it's okay you can just think of it every time na mwambia hivyo unaona yeah wow so when she said yes ulisikiaje obviously poor sana uh -huh. because I, I, no okay actually and we were texting mm -hmm. then i can remember yes unaona so hapo hapo nikachukua kupiga simu ni confirm sauti kama ni kweli ama nimesikia ama ni mtu mwingine ya kwa simu exactly uh -huh. yeah so bana nimempigia ni mwambia kila i mean niambia kila kitu and mm -hmm. tukaongea we had a good conversation hapo mm -hmm. ndo tulianza mm -hmm. Um, let me ask you guys mm -hmm. I'm feel like uh, you too young mm -hmm. in into such a relationship ambayo mnaona ni serious mm -hmm. it needs commitment okay so see, okay my first thought what I'm kwambia ukweli unaona the period yenye mnaendelea anga ku date ndo mm -hmm. kuna vitu unaanza ku realize unaona yeah. so mm -hmm. pale tulikuwa we are too young to kuanza kufikiria kuna kitu inaitwa commitments mm -hmm. unaona kuna kitu inahitaji lazima u focus on mm -hmm. so at that time i guess ilikuwa tu ni tuongee we meet mm -hmm. have fun or discuss mm -hmm. issues maybe tuna, tunaongea vitu za maana nini na nini mm -hmm. i could ask about her family ananiambia yake so unaona at that time mm -hmm. i don't think so kulikuwa na kitu tulikuwa tunajua kuna kitu inaitwa commitment mm -hmm. unaona yeah. mm -hmm. But now later you come later to, on after yes. one to two years mm -hmm. then no kuja ku realize okay so hivi ndo kuna endanga okay yeah. so hapo itabidi nijitahidi kimwanaume unaona yeah, yeah. Uh, uh. oh nice so how how has it been uh, the journey has been great okay hapo mali tumefika mm -hmm. it has been 
poor kabisa mm-hmm. because uh, one thing i think i have to thank god for mm-hmm. nilipatana na mtu tunaelewana unaona mm-hmm. yani tunaweza kuwa tumekosania kitu kidogo mm-hmm. but at the end of the day mm-hmm. ako ready kunisikiza yani it's very hard upate mm-hmm. like we have that big misunderstanding yenye hataki kunisikiza sijui mwingine hataki kusikia unaona mm-hmm tunaelewana mm-hmm. you see mm-hmm. so siezi sema the journey has been okay imekuwa na challenges mm-hmm. but it has been great cuz mm-hmm. we both understand each other mm-hmm. kila mtu ako ready kusikiza mwingine actually kwanza yeye sana ako he has ako ni ile kitu ya kusikiza mtu sana mm-hmm. you see mm-hmm. si ule wa kurusha mkono eti ah wewe sasa enda siji eh mm-hmm. so hiyo imefanya hadi mimi mwenyewe nikalan cuz mm-hmm. niliona ye, he has that listening ear yeah. and i had to adapt that to mm. so hata tukikosana bado kuna point ai tutaambiana tukae chini sasa tuonge mm. imekuwa too much mm-hmm. tunaketi tunaelewana na inaisha hivyo wow. you see mm-hmm. yeah wow let's <laughs> let's bring in the issue of parents here mm-hmm. uh, have you told your parents that uh, you're dating 101% yes, 101% <laughs> exactly it's more than was as you are calling it <laughs> okay one thing i will i'll be cocksure about mm. my mom tulikuwa tunaelewana kutoka kitambo mm. so anything i could do mm. my mom ningemwambia unaona mm. so sometimes unajua my mom mimi nikishi say nikishi meru mm. kusoma meru yeye alikuwa na Nairobi mm. unaona mm. So at that time to get communicate ananizo chapata dem baada sasa after nimemaliza shule. Yeye anakuuliza hiyo. Chapata dem. Kujua. Aja kutafuta. Unaona? So at that time I was like hey mama ako unaweza kosa. Unaona? So my mom na ujaniambia. Unaona? So at that time me we were, we were, I was comfortable telling my mom everything. Actually hata tukikosana ningemwambia ni mwambie hey mom leo tumekosana. Jo eh rada sije nitafanya aje. Ni mama ambaye wewe ni mwanaume ndio kitu uonge. So unaona? So at that time even though alipatana wakaongea mm-hmm. and that's how they they talked mm-hmm. wakajuana kabisa deeply wow yeah. so mpaka wameonana yeah washaonana yeah and uh, from your side <laughs> actually from my side it was a bit tough kwa sababu mimi sikuwa okay mamangu ni yule especially i guess all siji kama ni all parents wana kuanga hivyo but ukiwa shule mm-hmm. kuna ile mzazi yako strict na wewe mpaka unaona ai hapa bana there's time for everything <laughs> eh <Yeah>, but <laughs> ile kitu ilinisaidia ni eti we had uh, nilikuwa nime complete high school mm. so okay at first siko open eti after tulianza ku date nikaenda nikamwambia mama i have ah uh, no mm-hmm. it took some time mm-hmm. but after after a while nikona stamp feature forever unaona mm. so it's high time nende tu ni mkalishe chini kama mzazi mm. i ju hata wakijifanya hawajui they know mm. this mm. wanajua so mm. niko na haina haja kujificha mm. and i went i spoke to her mm. actually hata nilimpea simu akaongea na the first time before they met mm. you see mm. nikampea simu cuz uh, at times she was like and Ukienda ni ukienda nikuulize how ni marafiki wangapi unakuanga na uko nje mm-hmm. and I'm like I only have one friend him so uh-huh. and I was telling her sasa mom umeishi ukiniuliza 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 now here I, this is the He's day the guy. so this is the guy uh-huh. ukitaka unaweza ongea na and, he, and she was okay imagine she uh-huh. was like eh hey, but yes mimi nataka kumjua at least uh-huh. I know my daughter is in safe hands hata yeah. nikisikia tu sauti uh-huh. Nitajua what can yeah. a guy he have is that yeah. But then <laughs> let me tell you one thing. <laughs> you see the day that alinipea simu nikaongea naye mm-hmm. after nimeongea na bitha tuliongea for almost 5 minutes to 3 to 5 minutes. Mm-hmm. But your conversation ilinipea hopes kabisa <laughs> juu the way tuliongea mm-hmm. then hata ni bado hujakutana na mamake and mm-hmm. she's like yes my son. Ah, ni kwa labas. Hivyo. Hivyo. Hii nyingine nakujea. Hiyo hiyo hata sitaki kubishana sana. Eh so akati tunaongea na niambia yes my son. Ya nilikuwa nataka tu kujua akiendanga ni ndanga wapi. Nikamwambia uh-huh. yes ana kujanga kwangu. Mm. So unaona so hiyo conversation ili ili ni build sana pia. Unaona? Mm. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. So w- when your parents met him for the first time, mm. how did they react? Isikuwe ni kuna Kenya walikuwa nayo kwa kwa, kwa mind <laughs> totally... then kwa ground wakapata vitu ni different <laughs> yeah uh-huh. imagine they were totally okay mm-hmm. yani it was like they had even met 
before unaona uh-huh. any there was nothing new mm. kabisa mm. so ile siku sasa wali meet face to face mm. i was like so mom huyo sasa ndio faruk mm-hmm. hivi ndivyo anaka mm-hmm. ndio huyu sasa in person yeah. seti kwa simu mm. and she was like wow my mm-hmm. son nimengojea sana kukuwa yani wow they were it was like they had met before mm-hmm. any there was nothing new mm-hmm. it was ah yeah my son mm-hmm. nimekuona leo aki nimeka bila sijui nime, nimetaka sana kukuona you see mm-hmm. his story too yeah, uh. there was nothing new my dad mm-hmm. was okay mm-hmm. he was like ah daddy mambo poa yani mm-hmm. adi mimi mwenyewe nilishtuka mm-hmm. wow. yani ai and of eh. course you are very happy very Mwana kijana amekubalika <laughs> eh. i was very happy eh because we knew we were serious about each other so kupata ile confirmation kutoka kwa wazazi mm. it meant a lot unaona mm. yeah unajua mm. mm. the funny part mm. you see the way tuliongea na mama kwa simu mm. and we never met tukakuja tukapatana and then all of a sudden tumeongea fiti mm. like nikawa tu tumejua na miaka 10 mm. the same thing happened to had that because babaki alivokuja mm-hmm. i was expecting hata nitago hata nisalibia hivi mm-hmm. nini but she came and hugged me hivyo wow. tu you know wow. so i was like ai so una jamii so ni eh, eh, eh mimi nilikuwa na ile uoga na muuliza guy babako ameniona amesema dada naambia relax tulia yako sawa <laughs> so una jua uji uamini <laughs> tunaona eh, eh, aje uh-huh. when you hear stories kutoka kwa marafiki zako anakuambia inakuanga hard mimi heri ni happy unaona yeah. but one thing mimi najuanga nayo na kuanga na confident mm-hmm. unaona so mm-hmm. si, I knew it and no, then no, no, uh, exactly <laughs> so mimi pale hiyo siku hadi nilikuwa nabuliza ni nwe ngo mpya ama nifanye aje sasa <laughs> sana shangaa nita, nitaenda aje uh-huh. i am not relax you should just be yourself no no uh-huh. yeah. alafu another thing mm-hmm. I'm, i'm one person who kwanga social na watu sana mm-hmm. so unaweza unaweza nipeleka kwa watu sijui unikutana tuna tumejuana na tunapiga story, story yeah. Yeah. so but uh, because wakati nilipata na mama yake si kupata na mama yake peke yake i met <coughs> almost familia yake <coughs> yote ah, wow. yeah. and at the, at the end of the day tukiketi kwa gari mm-hmm. huko unaweza to differentiate hawa wao wa exactly you know <laughs> yeah uh-huh. so, so but, even before you married mm-hmm. you you already feeling like this is home exactly nilikuwa nika nimeshakaribishwa mm-hmm. kabisa ju unyona difference by the unyona tu yenyewe nimetoka nimetoka na wao area moja wow yeah. wow that's nice yeah. Yeah. wow <laughs> who knows to the parents santeni kwa kuitikia kijana and then uh, now the hatan mm. wazazi wako ku meet pi kwa the same thing iko hard okay wao hajawe ongea au kuongea kwa waliongea kwa simu tu ile hi hi hivi na hivi but au kwa sikuwa nimemwambia officially mom mm. ni hivyo mm. but at the end of the day ile siku yenyewe walipatana mm. alimkaribisha tu home mm. na wakakaa wakakunywa chai wakaongea everything mm. na at the end of the day akaenda home kwao mm. na kila kitu ilikuwa too smooth mm. yeah. so after that ndo akaanza kunipigia simu na nilisema sasa yeye kama tuseme nimetoka nimeenda town mm. nimeenda wapi na mwambia ananipigia simu anoza na uko wapi leo naomba niko town anjo tuko na mail msalimia unaona so unaweza kuta sometimes anataka kuongea na yeye mm-hmm. sometimes anataka ananiuliza akoaje ama tukiwa tu kwa nyumba all of a sudden tu mm-hmm. anaanza story ya mm-hmm. akoaje 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 unaona so hapo mm-hmm. ndo tu walielewana wow yeah. wow yes and if you're there you're watching you can mm-hmm. you can see there's a gap today i always make sure watu wako pamoja but tonight there is a gap <laughs> <laughs> because it's not yet sealed <laughs> yeah but a time is coming and we are going to go to celebrate with them and we shall go to be witnesses yes and now i want us to know why or what is making them mm-hmm. to take all this long mm-hmm. four years and you have met the parents the parents have said tuko sawa what is it that is taking them wakae hivi tuanze na nani miaka 4 kawaida kawaida ladies first okay miaka 4 wazazi wamekubali wewe umekubali marafiki wamekubali hata sisi kama media tumekubali <laughs> ndio maana tumewaita ni nini inawazuia <laughs> i guess okay 
mi Kenya naweza sema ni eti bado not commitments not anything we are ready for to make all the commitments to go ready na kila kitu mm-hmm. one thing ni eti bado tunataka kuwa financially stable kabisa yani okay usijini nitakuelezea aje eh yeah, because uwelewe. i want to know when you say financially stable kabisa <laughs> ni mpaka mununue jet ama ni okay. ah. <laughs> let, let me explain it to you <laughs> so our main goal ni kufungua biashara mwanzo mwanzo biashara zenye tunajua kesho in case of anything mm-hmm. tuko na support system yetu yenyewe unaona mm-hmm. so hiyo ndio inakuanga couples those who are married you are watching <laughs> Listen to this guy. <laughs> so our, our main main target kubwa ukwa ni kufungua yani businesses zenye tunajua in case mm-hmm. of anything mm-hmm. ziko hapo kuto support pia. Unaona? Mm-hmm. So hiyo ni nakuanga as that's the only target yetu yenye sasa tumebakisha mm-hmm. because when you talk about commitments this mean go ready I'm 100% sure about that. Uh, of course Niko the sawa. moment you went to the parents exactly. yeah. inamaanisha yeah. you guys are committed. And bad daughter your four years it's mm-hmm. not that easy. Four years kukana mtu inamaanisha umemsoma sana. Mm-hmm. If yeah. you truly took your time kumsoma mm-hmm. it means mm-hmm. uko ready kumoa unaona mm. yeah so mi 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 nasemanga okay yeah tuna tuna joint kwa na youtube we have that youtube thing mm-hmm. we so easy to grow up sana vizuri mm. things are okay nini yeah. mm. but still we feel mm. we need something this that ka spark we need mm. unaona mm. ile nyenye tunasema eh enye this is a bavaka thing mm-hmm. enye ukipita hapo unasikia this mm-hmm. is a bavaka yani business big of which mm-hmm. we are there step mm-hmm. ahead kufungua mm-hmm. kitu kama hiyo yeah, yeah. Uh, you know there's something you guys told me offline mm-hmm. and um, it really impressed me mm-hmm. that amtai kufanya wedding msumbue watu yeah that's mm-hmm. true nataka ku sponsor wedding yenyewe nyinyi wawili amtai exactly. mm-hmm. mm-hmm. kusumbua watu exactly amtai kufanya pre wedding nini ni nyinyi wawili wacha tusumame that's one on a business hapo ndo inaingilia unaona yeah so tukiwa na business tukiwa na hizo vitu mm-hmm. 100% uta, uta expect sasa tuanze tena kutegemea watu mm-hmm. tutajua sisi wenyewe venye tutajipanga mm-hmm. because we are used to do our own things mm-hmm. yeah but yes. o, 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 what about her, mm-hmm. if these businesses you guys want to start mm-hmm. they take forever Not, a, not as in forever forever mm-hmm. but 10 years what happens you guys will continue just dating me I'm not sure it can take 10 years no it, it can't wewe jamaa na imani it can't <laughs> it can yani ni ile tu tunataka tujipange vizuri before you know mm. getting married mm. is a big step mm. see eti kitu kidogo unaweza sema eh it's not a joke eh, mchezo mm. hawezi tu amka mm. useme na nenda i'm going to get married no mm. Mm. it's a big step mm-hmm. and because say we have like tunajulikana mm. mtu kama wewe you want to come to our wedding you know mm. and sure bet you'll get an invite yes so ah, nikikosa nitaisimamisha <laughs> <laughs> hatuwezi taka kufanya <laughs> kitu kitu ina yani itafungia watu mm. there are a lot of people who might want to come mm. so afadhali tujipange vizuri mm. so that ate kifika ni kufanya your wedding we do something big mm-hmm. kila mtu mwenye anataka kukuja the one, all the ones who want to witness our love watakuja mm-hmm. one big thing mm-hmm. na nivo you see mm-hmm. so that's why lazima tujipange vizuri mm-hmm. it's a big step mm-hmm. you see yeah uh, have you been getting uh, pressures from family members not, not not family no. members about marriage thing uh-huh. not no. really uh-huh. not and friends okay Fre- about marriage thing yes, no yes. not really but kitu yenye tunakonga tumepoa pressure nayo sana ni kuhusu mtoto imagine pressure to pressure kama uko kwa social media uh, but yeah. maybe it's because mm. wanaona ai ah, ah, watu wame date for years mm. ni yeah. nini Ah, Asa yeah. wao wao sema si hata hiyo four years mm. what they normally quote on wala zamanga nyi me date paka mmefanana si mzae tu hata mtoto tuone mtoto tuone mtoto siangue kwa majaribu tafadhali msiangue kwa majaribu si nimekwambia we normally we normally try do things our own way yeah. no, no. Mm. Yeah. and you guys are principled yeah exactly and i love that yeah. i love that yeah. and i want to speak to young people mm-hmm. out there mm-hmm. speak to girls speak to ladies eh mm-hmm. Uh, I mean yeah, speak men. to men, men yeah. young men 
not boys. <laughs> it's okay, whatever. <laughs> um, maybe there are those young people, mm-hmm. they are dating, but wanaka kama wana, wana feature, mm-hmm. wana jificha. What would you tell them? Okay, in my opinion, mm-hmm. I think a lot of people squeeze wana jificha because mm-hmm. umesikia vitu zina trend eti in Nairobi, it's a big bedroom, unona vitu mm-hmm. kama hizo. Mm-hmm. Yani, watu wanasema mna date siku tatu mna achana. Mm-hmm. Yani there is no hakuna ile true love. Mm-hmm. Squeezy by the way a lot of people especially our age yeah. hakuna mwenye anaamini in true love. Hii gener- generation eh, Z. Hii generation. <laughs> hii generation yetu hakuna mwenye ha- anaamini in true love. Mm-hmm. And that's why we are here mm-hmm. to show that love can work. Yes. Na, it doesn't matter uko young mm-hmm. ama nyinyi sasa mmeoana si lazima eti mkwe wa ze kabisa ndo yeah. sasa muanze mm. kupendana you see mm. you can start mkiwa mm. young as long as nyinyi wa wili mnajua mnataka nini mm. it can work mm. sasa sikuizi watu wanajificha because mm. they are not sure unaona anaona mm. ai naweza announce kesho nimeachwa aibu mm. unaona eh. so that's why kila Nimeka mtu kwa mitandao all of us <laughs> kila mtu anajua eh. sasa that's why mm. wanajificha mm. but kuna mi uambia watu kila siku hata mtu akikuja tu Instagram yangu anilize what does it take to make love work mi uambia watu mm-hmm. tafuta tu yani kuna mtu tu utapata mm-hmm. and things zita flow yani ni kama kuna mtu anakuanga ametumwa kwako na Mungu kitu mm-hmm. kama hiyo mm-hmm. kwa sababu i don't if i if i was dating actually si kitu kama hiyo Hmm? Hii kitu kama si Mungu. Zimu, awezi, haiwezi. Haiwezi. That's it's true. God. Haiwezi. It's God. Uh-huh. Yeah. Uh-huh. So ju kama yeye, if uh-huh. I, maybe I was dating someone else right now. Uh-huh. To, maybe tungekuwa tumeachana juu. Labda yeye hangekuwa ananisikiza. Uh-huh. But in him, uh-huh. naona he has all the qualities. Uh-huh. Yaani hakuna hata misunderstanding, misunderstanding inaweza kuwa kubwa mpaka tuachane. Uh-huh. Ju any i don't get it ni mm. wacha tuseme tu ni mungu God. so there is always that one person mm. when anakuanga hapo for you mm. and if you find them mm. usiogope yani jaribuni kila kitu yenye mnaweza to mm. make that thing work mm. but squeeze eh so eh. you tell the young ladies to be to rest yeah uh, they should be assured yeah they should be and that is to come from the men they also need to assure these ladies yeah I'm assuring you. Yeah. We ni wewe tu. Eh, Hakuna na, mwingine. Yeah, na pia eh. si rush. Don't rush. Yeah. Kuna wale watu umeachana leo, kesho uko soko, umerudi soko. Mm. <laughs> ah ah, usi mm. rush, we mm. ngojea tu. Yaani mm. haitakuumiza kungojea, unaona? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. just wait. Kuna ule mm. mtu mmoja atakuja mzuri. Mm. Jusa ukienda ukirush kila mahali mm. utapotea. Mm. Si. And you hurt yourself. Yeah. Mm. So ngojia there is that one person who will come just for you yeah. and it will work. Wow. That's it. Wow. Thank you. Uh-huh. Okay. Talk so to those young boys. <laughs> okay, for me it's simple. Kina njema na kina twenty one. For me it's simple. This 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 thing in a in a wanaume squeeze wao wana quote wanasema wanawake bila pesa huwapati. Let me be honest. Mm-hmm. Me I've never believed in such thing. I I know finance must be there. Mm-hmm. That's true. Yeah. But don't say women love money. Mm-hmm. Because it's true finance loves me quite Yeah. Mm-hmm. But let me tell you bro, if if I started this thing with with a girl that mwenye siku ana kitu yoyote mm. mpaka inafika point naweza naweza kuwa stable naweza jishughulikia hata kama ni masomo naweza ambia wazazi pumzikeni nifanye hizi vitu zote mm. and while nilikuwa na yeye unaona so she she saw me nikianza nikibuild na paka point nimefika unaona so one thing advice yenye ningepea wanaume try your luck unaona just try It, it will never cost you wacha kuenda ukisema ati damn ni pesa ni pesa ni pesa because this days what what men fear ni yo commitment pia unaona yeah, kuwa yeah. unafeel mm. kama udem atakuwa ananiambia eh hey, nimfanye kila kitu nini nini mm. nini mm. of which mwanamke ni, 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 ni different uh, ni wat, wako tofauti sana na sisi unaona mm. the truth is pia tunafuatwa shughulikie mm-hmm. unaona hiyo ndio mm. kitu mimi najua mm. so mwanzo mm-hmm. wakati nilikuwa sina anything mm-hmm. 
how did I try my best to earn mm -hmm. her? Mm -hmm. Nilimchukua through kumonyesha to one thing. Mm -hmm. Only be, being there for her. Mm -hmm. That's mm -hmm. the step, the that big step. giving her quality exactly. time. Exactly. Mm -hmm. That's the so big step. So kwa hauna do, but ana una una mpea time yake. Exactly. Na mpea attention. Time. Exactly. Yondo, mm -hmm. because me feel yondo kitu mwana miki utaka sana. Mm -hmm. Ina attention na ila kumonyesha, mm -hmm. enye ukona future. That's mm -hmm. the most important thing actually. Yeah. Kumonyesha mwana mke, ukona future ndani yako. Mm -hmm. Because one thing ni mekuja kurealize, mm -hmm. kukana manzi yangu, mm -hmm. yu niambianga mostly, mm -hmm. there's something I saw in you, that future thing. You know, mm -hmm. Ka, let's, keti chini umonyeshe, eh, manzi ni ngekuwa na future hivi, mm -hmm. hivi no ngetaka kufanya, hivi ndo plan zangu. Because actually whatever we are doing right now, it's something we, we discussed mm -hmm. back then. Yeah. And the, it's exactly what we are doing right now. You know, so it means if I can, we can dream of that thing, na tunaifikisha hapa, mm -hmm. ni nini neza stop. Wow. If apo kuna God na kuna kujiaminia, ni nini ngine basi? Mm. Yeah. God so, first, God first, then ujiamini. Ujiamini mm. ki mwanaume. Mm. Yeah. Usiseme them ni person, there's nothing like, like that. that. Yeah. Finance must be there, mm. don't mjinue mji ki maisha. Mm. Lakini you can also build together if mm. you want to. Mm. Mm. Yeah. You know, okay. let me cut yes. you short kidogo. Yeah. You know, nilikuja kurealize, actually, as women, we look for someone with vision. Una vision. Like, ukienda kwa mwanaume ataka maana do bora mm. kuna ile vision unasikia kuna ile mwanaume anaweza kuambia eh enyewe mimi sina do lakini mm. ni i'll work hard nikipata hii pesa hivi na hivi nimejipanga hivi nimejipanga hivi unaona mm. at least mm. unaona kuna lakini sasa wanaume wengi wana fail wapi wana Hawana fail vision. kwa hawana vision mm. unaona mm. sasa a lot of guys out there wana they are in they are taking drugs unaona mm. yani you're not how judge panga you no, don't have jelewi. that plan yani no eh, lady want to come to mwanaume hajielewi sasa alafu exactly. mm. a lady akikata kukude tunasema oh anataka, mm, pesa. anataka pesa no it's Ana not maringo. eh mm -hmm. you see mm -hmm. ni kale tu ka vision mm -hmm. na kumuonesha yenyewe mm -hmm. i have this plan mm -hmm. ni, ni kuna kitu tu nakosa ndio ni establish plan mm -hmm. but akiona ile plan atakusaidia ati ku achieve you see mm -hmm. As long as you have the vision and the plan, mm -hmm. she'll help you achieve it. Mtata after niwa wili. Yeah. You see? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's even though ni likuja kuona. Wow. Mm -hmm. So what are some of the challenges you guys have gone through during this time? Ya kudate. Kwa time mefika meza ma, ah, hii kitu ikai. Kwa ni hiko nini? Eh, challenges. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> <Men> in front. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so the biggest challenge was okay, when we started YouTube, there's there's no supportive system ilikuwa. It was just us. Unaona? Mm -hmm. So hakuna ile tu una unaambiwa una, una, una because one YouTube, mm -hmm. YouTube ni in, in kama investment. Yeah. Unaona? Mm -hmm. So it will take time before yanze kuku pay back mm, mm. so at that time to kianza there was sometimes unakuta unakuta tuko kwa barabara mm. tuko na tuko na kitu kama 200 ama 100 sasa hiyo hata tujui kama kitu kuna kitu inaitwa uh, kuweka wifi mm -hmm. so tuko nayo 100 and we still want to post that video mm. and then tunajiuliza tutume tu, tukiweka hiyo 100 ikiingia ikimezo because youtube pia unajiona tikuanga eh, yeah. mm. so tunajiuliza tukitumia tuki hapo tutaba tutakuwa na fair tutafanya aja tujakula hadi mm -hmm. so at that time i felt like it was it, it was pushing us so hard mm -hmm. but the funny part hatukwa tuna ile roho ya give up mm. unaona mm. na one thing atujai ketishwa chini tukaambwa this is how you go about youtube mm. this is how you do we have never done such a thing. Atujawai peana mtu atupushia ati account. Mm. Atujaya pea mtu atusaidia ati kuskuma YouTube channel. Mm. Ati atuambia na to support kama manager. Nini mm. nini. Nothing. Mm. Tuliamua ni sisi. Mm -hmm. Tukafanya na tukafanya everything. But mwanzo mwanzo it was a bit challenging. Because mm -hmm. so, ata fair kukuja kwenda mali. Una, unajua na zaitu wana mtu wambi. Hey, Manze muna tuba manga sana. Si mkuja leo mtu visit area. Mm -hmm. And hapo umitu wana mtu mkumbu wa. Mtu mwenye wana kulipia kila kitu. Mm -hmm. But then ukone ile uoga. Utaki kumitisha. Mm -hmm. We mwenye wezi ji. We wezi hati yo pesa una fair kupeleka pale. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. it, it was a bit challenging. Wow. Sana. Wow. Sana. Are there other challenges? Uh, I guess. Eh, tukianza kudate. The relationship wise sasa. Mm -hmm. 
the biggest challenge was kwele before tuele uh-huh. uh-huh. mm. for me that was the biggest challenge kwa sababu sikuwa nimemuelewa kabisa mm. kuna vitu angefanya naona ah sasa huyu mm-hmm. ni mbana una alafu <laughs> 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 pia mimi nilikuwa naona kuna vitu zingine ningefanya mm-hmm. ai ama vitu zingine akiniambia naona ah huyu ananikazia sasa unaona so like ku, kuna wakati maybe for example i had some type of friends tukianza ku date so he was like ai ah ah you know sasa sisi kwetu ni mashambani shambani kidogo it's far from town uko ndo tulijenga sasa yeye kwao kulikuwa town area and the friends i had walikuwa wa town you see pia walikuwa wa, wanaishi huko town so and every day maybe aki, ya kitoka definitely ata atawaona unaona so when he sees me hanging out with these friends a colleague nilikwambia huyu rafiki yako huyu achane na mwanza ni kundu sasa sasa huyu Joana ato kunan sasa ako ah ah sasa mimi huyu ameanza kunibo mbona ananiambia wewe hata ujimali tumetwana na huyu msichana ni rafiki yangu ile kujitetea and he's like mimi ndo najua Kenya nakwambia wachane mm. huyu ataku mislead tu mm. mimi najua mm. ataku mislead mm. sasa mimi naona ananikazia lakini he has that reason mm. na hataki pia ku paint a bad picture on the friend unaona so mm. yeah ko tu ah, no just stop yeah. wacha tu mm. so unaona vitu sasa kama hizo hiyo kuelewana mm-hmm. so me i took my time mm. Nikauliza okay ananiambia hivi na hivi na hivi mm-hmm. what's the reason behind mm-hmm. you see mm-hmm. and I'll come nimuulize so mbona uliniambia hivyo mm-hmm. mbona uliniambia ni achane na huyu mm-hmm. and he's like the reason is ni hivi na hivi na hivi mm-hmm. oh so ni one oh by the way ina make sense mm-hmm. you see mm-hmm. nimemuelewa mm-hmm. yeye yeah, yeah, the same thing mm-hmm. kitu aelewi kwangu ama anaona sasa ina mbo mm-hmm. ana take time anakuja na niliza so why you mboni kwa hivi na hivi namuelezea mm. you see mm. so your process ya kuelewana it really took time challenges tunakosania vitu kidogo kidogo but at the end of the day mm. tukaelewana kabisa mm. yani tuka solve kila kitu mm. yeah wow but, yeah. but but do you know mm. one one uh, on that time yenye tulikuwa tunakosana i guess it's the time nililearn vitu mingi sana mm. unaona mm. So wakati nilikuwa namwambia hizo vitu zote kumuongelesha nini hivyo I felt like pia nilikuwa na mpush sana unaona and uh, na, na, one thing mamangu niambianga pia uniambianga ukipenda mtu mm. you don't make them change unaishi venye na wao venye wako unaona mm. so mi ilifika point nilianza kumuelewa venye yako unaona so tukiwa na issue mm-hmm. ninge ninge cool down Unaona because maybe moja yetu ni hyper unaona yeah. yeah and mostly it was me yeah. unaona so mimi ningekuja chini mm-hmm. tuketi tuonge unaona hiyo mm-hmm. ni nimetoa hiyo hiyo ni nio another thing about friends ni, ningemfundisha ni, unaona tuseme kama maybe tuko na shida kubwa imetusumbua tumeketi tunasumbuka sisi wawili mm-hmm. one thing question yenye ningemuuliza ningemuuliza wako wapi au marafiki mm-hmm. unaona wako wapi mm-hmm try and call one one kama atakusaidia mm-hmm. because you be hanging with them mimi nikikwambia hivi na hivi na hivi you, you unaona kama maybe na kuonea mm-hmm. but sasa hizi uko na shida yeah maybe mm-hmm. na wachukia but mm-hmm. I, i know what i'm tell, I'm mm-hmm. telling you unaona so at that time pia tukaanza kujua kuishi na watu wenye wako supportive pia unaona mm-hmm. yeah watu wenye kesho watu ukiwa down unajua mm-hmm. nikipigia simu mm-hmm. na saidika mm-hmm. unaona Yeah so at that time lessons ilikuwa mingi pia mm. See, it's not about challenges but lessons in, they made us who we are right now no na maybe hata mm. kama singekuwa na correct na na learn kutoka kwake hata ungekaa hiyo four years mm. ningekuwa mimi nimeboeka nimeenda mm-hmm. yeah wow so sasa mna plan kuka meka ngapi ndo hii story tunini <laughs> <laughs> It, it's, it's not about sinimekwambia it's about kufungua tu biashara of which so biashara ikienea iki busy ya kuna yenye imeanza size about mm. products mm-hmm. unaona mm. so tunaona tuki tuki enhance tu tukifungua hizo products product zake mm. za kam, ye, 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 ye ndo ana make ah. unaona mm-hmm. so tukifungua hizo za makeup thing ah wow yeah. uh-huh. so akisha maliza kufungua mm-hmm. well, well huku mimi pia nifikire kitu ya kufanya muhimu pia mm. I guess I to take more than one to two years nitakuwa tutakuwa ready nitakuja nitakuja ninagojea sana and so as as we wind up mm-hmm. there is there is 
as you are doing the introduction mm -hmm. kuna jina ilingia hapo Farouk yes and uh, this girl is a christian yeah Farouk uh, Ab Ab Abdi 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 yeah. one muslim mm -hmm. one muslim yeah and uh, she's a christian yeah so how how are you going about that okay so uh, the first thing singe mimi naonanga okay yeye ye, kuwa christian mimi kuwa muislamu pale yenye nazaleta confusion sana na sitaki ni kwa watoto unaona mm -hmm. because uh, i felt on the same trap unaona because my mom she was a christian my dad was a muslim unaona so ulikuwa nikuta mara leo niko huku mara kesho nimeenda hivi uh -huh. okay so unaweza kuta at the age of 1 to 10 nili spend kwa church but at 10 to paka point sahi niko nimespendia mosque so ina inakuwa challenging juice juu ni wapi nitaka mm. unaona siko decide nina ni peer pressure so the same things taki happen kwa watoto wangu mm. so i guess at some point we have to sit decide which mm. side are we mm. unaona mm. which side should we go mm. ni, ni wapi tu, tu, tuende sasa mm. tushikane mkono tuamue ni hii mm. na nothing should change mm. yeah. your parents are christian yeah your your mom and your dad yeah how did they take that that okay. you're dating a, a muslim i guess there's a same about the jawahid haya so maybe i'm going to transit na wewe wewe imeku hit hizi kwa hata wewe haijaku hit mimi meni hit i know i'm dating a muslim mm -hmm. but kwao mm -hmm. i guess bado kuna kale kuna kale ka ai jawahid bado this guys ai kweli huyu jamani muslim unaona <laughs> So I guess what what we need to do it's a fika to we need to sit ju hatuwezi ongea tu sisi wawili we need to involve the parents mm -hmm. to juice sasa ni aje mm -hmm. kama but personally mm -hmm. I'm flexible mm -hmm. if my parents agree mm -hmm. on me changing to muslim I will ah you see mm -hmm. yeah I'm flexible acha tu niseme mimi niko flexible mm -hmm. Actually ni kwa uh, since I was small nilikuwa napenda kuwa muslim. Hata nilikuwa najifunga vitamba na mama ngo amekuja ananiambia sasa wewe shida yako ni <laughs> unaona my friends were also muslim. I had a, I have a lot of muslim friends up to now. Mm. Eh, mm. so nimeshikutamani hiyo hiyo dini. Mm. If if it goes well mm. my parents wakubali waseme yeah, it's it's okay you can you are a grown up you can change to whatever you want i'm flexible i can go to muslim but wakikata pia itabidi to work something out because mm -hmm. atwezi katu hivi but i remember offline he he said that uh, he is also ready to come back to christianity yeah, yeah in our yeah. conversations is also ready actually for me i'm okay also you okay as much as uh, tunaweza sema story ya wazazi nini mimi mm. niko sawa yeah and my parents wanajua obviously me it's me watani wataniambia unataka kuwa wapi wewe mimi niko sure isn't me kwamba i mean relationship yenye tume create na wazazi ni kama ya brother na sister so me i'm sure at the end of the day wataniambia wewe unataka kuwa wapi unaona so wewe unataka kuwa wapi sahi ni mimi sasa nakuuliza mimi kinyasha nakuuliza wewe unataka tuongee kila kitu leo hapa nataka tumalize kila kitu hapa eh unajua sasa this is being recorded so in future tutakwambia wewe but okay the the funny part aina za tuongea hapa unless tulete wazazi nitapaka wazazi hapa wote but no i'm saying before wazazi wakuje you as a person because at the end of it all you're the one to make this decision so for me because uh of late nimekuwa nikifuatilia dini ya ko ya muslim sana unaona so currently niko saidi ya muslim unaona so nimefuatilia dini nimelearn vitu mob i've been trying to catch up with a lot yenye ninge learn maybe nikiwa mtoto so na kuniambia tena ni change it will be a bit hard of which set inasema siwezi it will be a bit hard unaona but unajua ina depend venye venye kutenda on her situation also unaona yeah 
but uh, she told me that uh, of late mm. ata kuomba umekuwa ukiomba in Jesus name <laughs> uko sure eh? eh okay let me tell you one thing hakuna adza okay even the way inakuwa mm-hmm. so far si ati tumeomba nikisema sasa in Jesus name in Jesus name that's not what she, she meant mm-hmm. whatever she was telling you is kuna time tulikuwa tunaomba pamoja unaona mm-hmm. so leo ananiambia Babe, si wambe. So mimi ningeomba na lugha ya Kiislamu, unaona? Of which nilikuja ku realize why mbona nionge lugha yenye haielewi, unaona? Mm. So for us to be on one page, wacha nionge lugha yenye anaelewa pia. Mm. Unaona? Mm. So hiyo mm. ndio ilinifanya, ili, mm. ilinibidi mm. nijitoleza sasa nikwe mm-hmm. kama ni prayers mm-hmm. tunaomba pamoja. Mm. Unaona? Wacha ni usikie kenye, mimi nasikia venye wewe ukiomba. Mm. Unaona? Yeah. Mm. But um, you willing to leave muslim if wazazi wa kisema it's all about sacrifice it's all about sacrifice so you are ready to sacrifice ready. wow yeah. has religion contributed to uh, you guys taking all this time it has never mm-hmm. and it will never for us ah yeah. wow religion it's not a problem mm-hmm. we, at the end of the day we all worship one god mm-hmm. that's the key thing mm-hmm. una, yeah but mm-hmm. unajua god mm-hmm. yeah and you know how to kneel and pray mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Mm. so if your parents says wewe una remain kwa ukristo mhm na wake waseme wewe una remain kwa islam mm. kutaendaje <laughs> me i'm telling you one thing <laughs> Miss Yoni wa lazima wangu akikata. Mimi niko sure because unajua actually for you your mom is a Christian. Yeah, and my dad mm-hmm. he is a Muslim. Mm-hmm. So hakuna venye unajua of late pia nimekuwa nikikaa na mom sana because yeye ndo amini raise a lot because they were separate, unaona? Mm-hmm. So mimi nimekuwa nikikaa na mom. Mm-hmm. And kukaa na mom while she's not a muslim amekuwa kinifundisha pia a lot unaona mm. so at the end of the day me, me by the me, me between me and her i guess mimi ndo niko more flexible uh-huh. than her unaona mm. yeah wow. because at least the yeah, wazazi wake walikuwa one sided mm. unaona walikuwa christians both of them but for me mmoja alikuwa muslim and uh, my mom was a christian mm. so you are ready yeah, me, these ready. girls should be assured <laughs> no stepping down that you are ready to <laughs> leave your religion yeah mfanye maisha pamoja yeah. because you don't want to bring in yeah. confusion to the babies yeah. when you get married yeah. yeah um i'm told that our time is almost up mm-hmm. but you know what mm-hmm. in this show mm-hmm. uh before we wind up i always give a couple mm-hmm. a chance mm-hmm. to speak mm-hmm. uh, to each other mm-hmm. uh, and i know for you i know you much in love mm-hmm. you're not yet married mm-hmm. but you much in love mm-hmm. but i want you to give each other Assurity mm-hmm. that you are the one. Mnaweza tu angaliana. Okay. Okay. So, Angalia nini? Okay. Uh, you can start. You can turn. Turn. Yeah. Just turn. Unataka okay. umpatie assurance. Four years. They think for four years it is not a joke. Yeah, that's true. It is not so, a joke. Honestly speaking, mm-hmm. I know that uh, we we have a, lo- a long journey to step on. We have a lot to to figure out but we together struggle and uh, make it together we have a lot of plans we always wish for each other the best but i want to take you back and tell you that uh, being with you for the four years it has been a long journey that it has really brought me to a, to a sense that there's something called commitment and there's a there's a step you have to take to be with someone you see So uh, if 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 it's all about responsibilities just know that I will always step up for you. If it's a matter of doing something so that you be happy always I will be there for you because for the four years you have been with me and there's no that sign that in Tajambia it it is a red flag. I've never seen something that like that. You've always supported me no matter how down, down I was. So yeah, for me I want to tell you for the rest of this life I want to step on we as in i want to step this life with you for the rest of my life wow yeah. wow that's so nice <laughs> and this guy is a short <laughs> that hakuna mwingine yeah. and it's your turn purity okay so yeah as you have said we've been together for four years i know i know it's been a lot 
there has been a lot happening in our lives there there has been ups and downs and i want to assure you that each and every day i'll still stick beside you no matter what any storm the rainy days the sunny days i'll yeah. be here i'll here i'll be here to hold your hand through anything and i know we'll get through this together Thank you. <laughs> we'll go through everything um i can't wait to to say yes <laughs> someday <laughs> and maybe build our, our our have kids all that all any forever i just don't if there was really forever i would want it with no one else but you so that's it i wow. guess wow. <laughs> Thank you so much, guys, okay. for coming. Thank we really you. appreciate you. Thank How you. can people get in touch with you? Uh, you can follow us on uh, Instagram at it's Leila or Bavaka. Mm -hmm. Simply that. Mm -hmm. Leila and Bavaka. Bavaka. Mm -hmm. uh, Facebook, it's the same. Mm -hmm. Leila and Bavaka. Yeah. Uh, YouTube, it's Life with the Bavakas. Go subscribe there. Ata uki, uki to text, uki comment to Apple, mm. we'll give you our handles. Mm. Yeah, wow. that's it. Mm. Wow. Yeah. So make sure that you follow these guys. Mm. And thank you so much. Thank you even for being open. Thank mm. you for walking in light. You know, kutembea kwa muangaza. Kuna vijana wengi unapita kanyuma. Na wanasama, come we stay. Kwa ni yiko ni. But thank you very much for walking in light. And... Uh, I can't wait for that day. I'll come. <laughs> I'll Soon. come. Soon. Yeah, Soon. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you You're so much. Welcome. So thank, thank you for coming. Yeah. And uh, we wish you all the best in thank your planning. You. Uh, in this journey, may the Lord meet all your heart's desires. Thank and you. I pray that your bees in Giani. Thank you so much for coming. <laughs> yeah, well, Thank, you, sir. Thank you also Thank for you. welcoming us here. Yes. Yeah, we really appreciate. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Yes, and that marks to the end of tonight's show. What is your take home? As parents, what do you think? How should we talk to our children? Especially when they approach us, they want to get married. Then they take such long time how do you deal with that and the young people who are watching that lady you've been dating but it is high time you come out clear and be a to do story so thank you so much for coming and as always i tell you this show is not a monologue show so kindly leave a comment let us know what is your take home even as we end the show. This is Couples Wheel Show, and this is where we write down our love with, when we are alive, for we don't want our love story to be read. When we are six feet under, neither do we want our love story to be read when we are gone. And this is Wema TV, the voice of hope. My name is Willie Kinyash, and you know what? On 4th of June, there is something big that is happening. Yes, 4th of June. We are having couples will retreat. Ah, you need to save the dates. And charges are 7000 per couple. If you're coming alone, you'll pay 3500 And we are going to Naivasha Lake Oloiden. Register. Call that number under the screen. And your seat will be reserved. Twende Naivasha. And the theme of the day is unlocking the hidden love. Kosa Uchekwe. Good night. See you on Friday on Couples Will Show.